Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We are doing another what's new at Sephora because yes, it feels like I just did one of these, but I was looking and it's been an entire month and we know it. There are brand new things that are so exciting that are hitting the shelves that I just got my hands on yesterday, literally. Like I went to Sephora and I was like, please, I know you got the shipment, pull it out of the back. I'm actually not even exaggerating, that's what I did. So uh, we're gonna go through this haul and some of it is brand new product that is not even released yet that I was gifted either at an event or it was sent to me kindly from the company and I haven't tested them out yet and I thought, why not? Just share with you some new soon to be released stuff as well so this is just a whole brand new makeup for springtime and let's dig right in yesterday i had a meeting i had things to do that were boring and just really like the top of my list was to get to sephora to get my little paws on this guy right here the kat von d i had that upside down that's unacceptable the kat von d shade and light eye I have not even opened this. I haven't laid eyes on it. They didn't even have it displayed. I just saw that it was released online and I was like, I need this. I love the shade and light face so much that I need this. It is an all matte palette and dun, da, da, da. it's gorgeous. Oh my God, I can't even. I just, I want to play with this right away. Maybe this weekend I will do a tutorial. I wanted to do some type of a bohemian get ready with me kind of laid back style for Coachella because I am going to be at Coachella. I'm super excited about that. I haven't announced that yet, but I'm going. And I think something really neutral, all matte with like everything else glitzed up would be really fun. So let me know if you want to see that maybe for Tutorial Tuesday. Uh -huh. I'm barely touching it. Oh, magic. I just knew it. I knew it. I'm really, oh. I am so into this. Um, another palette that is not in the store, like look how like on top of it I am. I feel very like makeup pro right now. Um, I went to a Makeup Forever event, you guys may have seen during a first impressions, and they gifted us a bunch of product and I am most in love with this right here. It's a brand new palette. These are all the Pro Formula eyeshadows. This will be coming to a Sephora soon. And look how bright. And I almost said obnoxious, not obnoxious. I mean that in like a really good way, but like look at these. Oh my goodness. I am just getting my creativity juices going and I want to do like every crazy eye look out there. I'm even stepping a little bit outside of my comfort zone right now and wearing orange in my crease. Let me know how you feel about that. I'm just having kind of a play with eye looks type of a moment in my life right now. Um, Mm. Delicious. It is called the Palette 9 Artist Shadow. They have a more neutral toned one as well. Make It Forever also brought out a bunch of new lip colors. The Plexi Glosses are either going to have a cream finish and they are full, like full shine, full color, totally gorgeous or they will have this little kind of glimmery glitter finish and actually this one is the only one I've been using so far. This is dangerous. I'm putting it on without a mirror and it could end up being kind of gloppy, but we're going to go with it. Um, this is just a beautiful highlight gloss and will really just collect all of the light to the center of your lips and it's just beautiful. P.S. In my last uh, tutorial, everyone was like, but those lips, Tati, I can't even handle it. Those lips, those lips. That was the light. I just want to like let you guys know that when you do the trick where you highlight the center of your lips, sometimes if there are shadows coming over here and over here, it is gonna grab the light a little bit differently. So, um, so that's what's up. More things to get so excited about and I'm actually wearing one of them today and I already like my first impression without like going through my whole day is that it applied beautifully. This is from Hourglass. Now you guys know I love the ambient lighting powders and those are like a holy grail item of mine. Well, they brought out bronzers. Knowing how softly those powders apply, I was like, I need this. My bronzer has been kind of like a little bit weird and wearing off in weird places when I bronze up my entire uh, complexion. So far, I think this is phenomenal. I have the Luminous Bronze Light and the Radiant Bronze Light. They only have two shades. Both are gorgeous and it just, it doesn't even look like makeup. It just makes you look healthier. I kid you not. 
There's also a new invention from Cover FX, these custom cover drops. Now I am so excited to put these to the test because the claim with these is that you can mix them in literally just a crow that flew by my camera. The claim with this is that you can mix it in with a serum, with your moisturizer, with foundation that you already have that you want more coverage, and you can measure how many drops you put in for light to full coverage, so I'm so excited to try this. Let me know if you want a first impressions. I think with foundation especially, it's nice to kind of go through the whole day and see how it holds up. So really excited about this. I randomly was walking by the little Sephora display and I just like, I see shiny things and I just like go like that. Like I have to check out what's going on and they have a new shadow, Glimmer Shimmer. I don't know what you would call it. It's just very reflective, delicate type of shine and I like that. I got the shade Innocent Shell. And I also got the shade Mermaid Tail, which I love the name on this because it is exactly that kind of duochromatic, iridescent, mermaidy type of a shade. And I'm really, really excited to do a more cool tone type of a colorful look. Cool and colorful at the same time. Something I am super excited about, and I am putting a ton of skincare to the test right now because I do want to do an updated skincare routine and I do want to do like a hot or not on cleansers, moisturizers, and just kind of go more in depth on not just makeup, but some skincare, body care, whatnot as well. So I thought this was a really affordable, great opportunity for me to try out some new cleansers. It's 48 bucks, you get $125 worth of product in here. It's one of the Sephora favorites, you guys know, I always pick these up just so that I can try a ton of product. 11 cleansers in here, right now I'm going through the situation where I love my Benefit Roller Lash, but nothing will take it off, so I am hoping that the waterproof eye makeup remover or one of the oil cleansers will help me out because I need that help. I need help. While we are on the topic of skincare, I wanted to share with you guys, there are 10 winners for Giveaway Friday. I did not forget. We are still doing the pre-selected winner giveaway thing where if you are on my email list, you are automatically entered to win. And this week, 10 winners won Benigma Face Cream, which is a favorite which is a favorite of mine. I've actually talked about it a lot, so I'm gonna kind of just not ramble too much, but I did also snag a 50% off discount code, and that will be in the email that is going out to everyone. So even if you weren't one of the 10 winners to win a full-size jar, you have the opportunity to slice the price in half with a discount code that will be good for just a little bit. So be sure to check that email. Whee! The last thing I want to share with you is super cute, super exciting, and I didn't pay for this. This was sent to me, and it was like a good day at the P.O. box because Too Faced sent me this adorable makeup bag filled with their new melted metallic lip colors. I haven't seen these anywhere, so I'm like, hey, first look at this. That's pretty cool. They are very metallic-y. I've swatched and tried on one. I haven't really tried on the rest, but let's go through the colors really quickly. They have Melted Metallic Peony. They have Melted Metallic Tutu. Melted Metallic Violet. Melted Metallic Macaroon. Melted Metallic Dream House. Melted Metallic Debutante. Melted Metallic Jelly. And Melted Metallic Bunny. I already know I like melted lipsticks. They stay put. They're just really pigmented. I think they're a fun product. I love that they come out with different finishes from time to time. And I just wanted to show you that they have a metallic variety that is about to launch. So cute. I wanna know what items you are really excited about right now. And kind of, you know, whenever I do these hauls, I always ask you guys how you want to see the products put into motion. Like I just got these. Do we want tutorials? Do you want me to focus in on the skincare? Do you want a whole video with me trying on the different lipsticks? I'm always happy to hear your opinions and thoughts on how you want the videos to go because Lord knows I film so many of them. So let me know what you think and thank you so much for hanging out. Make sure you are subscribed if you aren't subscribed already so you don't miss any future videos and I hope you are having a great day and have a great weekend. I will see you guys next time. Mwah.